After suffering their only defeat of the season the week prior. Uh, Kenny, what's your play for this afternoon's game in Death Valley? Are you picking a side or eyeing the total here? Yeah, I'm playing a side here. Um, and I watched Clemson last week. I watched the game against uh, Louisville, and I had a big bet on, on Clemson and won the bet, but never felt comfortable. Never felt comfortable. That just a Clemson team that it just seemed like they would shoot themselves in the foot consistently the entire game. So um, this team ranks 29th defensively, uh, yards for play lots, 65th in offense. Um, they just have not been consistent. I'm going to take Miami here today. They need one win for a bowl game. They do have Pittsburgh next week. Van Dyke is out again today. But Ja'Cory Brown last week was his best game. I know it was Georgia Tech, but Georgia Tech's defense actually ranks close to what Clemson has done. Ja'Cory was 14 for 19, 136, and three touchdowns. He also ran it 19 times for 87 yards. He's a dual threat guy. I think Miami can move the football today with Ja'Cory Brown. And I'm going to take the points with Miami. Ah, Miami, where the weather is fantastic and the vibes around the college football team are terrible. <laughs> Mario Cristobal is out here offering the opportunity for parents to come and pick up their kids to take them away from this team. He's practically begging for this roster to be turned over and some of the players from the previous regime to leave so that he can go and recruit players that he believes are ready to buy in. I'm going Miami team total under. Because of all the things that I'm confident in this game, it is that Clemson's defense will be able to limit what Miami's offense is able to do. A Miami offense that has struggled mightily throughout the entire season and a Clemson defense that, man, is doing everything it can to keep Clemson's college football playoff hopes alive. Uh, Kenny's 100% right. The offense continues to shoot itself in the foot. The mistakes continue to pile up. I cannot trust Clemson to be able to cover this big number. And when I break the matchup down, the only side where I feel like I've got a good feel of what's going to happen is going to be Clemson's defense squeezing the life out of Miami's offense. We are going Miami team total under. <laughs> I echo what, what Chip just said. Look, this is when you look at this game and you're trying to put money down, first of all, don't put it a bunch of money down. Make like a $5 bet. I don't trust Clemson. I agree with Kenny offensively. Uh, but the only team I trust less than Clemson at this point in the season is Miami. This is a 5-5 five and five team. Uh, you look at them on film, they're wildly inconsistent with effort, guys. So you, you, I question whether this team even cares anymore. I like what Chip said. I mean, I'm going to make it even simpler. There needs to be a control alt delete immediately, and they need to get into the transfer portal, and they need to rebuild the roster in like three months. And if they do that, I think it'll be a different situation. Don't trust Clemson offensively. I have no idea what I'm going to get out of Miami, but I do think Clemson athletically can line up. I'm not sure if Miami even cares about being in this game. They can line up, put enough points on the board. I'll take Clemson in this situation. All right, John taking Clemson there. There's another look at everybody's picks. Chip uh, likes Georgia to get the job done and continue their dominant season. But the guys are split, as you can see, when it comes to Ohio State taking on Maryland. Also split when it comes to Clemson against Miami. Well, just a reminder as well, you can watch top-ranked Georgia taking on Kentucky at 3.30 Eastern on CBS. You can also stream the game on the CBS Sports app or watch it live on Paramount+. Plus. And right here on CBS Sports HQ, we will have you covered with pre-game, halftime and post-game, along with all the highlights and reaction. Do you want a sports network that delivers everything that matters about the game? The highlights, the picks, the instant analysis, no yelling, no fake debates, no politics. Hit the subscribe button and never miss a moment.